The man arrived at the island via the beach. He had a haunted, frightened look about him that showed a long and difficult journey. He approached the ruined village slowly and painfully as if he knew that this was a bad decision. I must continue. Anything to escape, he could feel the presence behind him getting closer and closer. He looked down one path, thinking this would be salvation. Then he saw him. The young boy looked at him without recognition or emotion. Could it be that he had no understanding of how serious their situation had become? Things behind me. Just when calm began to envelop him, a feeling of dread began to creep up. Something was at his feet, something terrible. It took all his will to look down, and there they were, ants. The boy had mentioned ants. They're everywhere, he had said. The toneless voice came back to his mind. They're everywhere. He had looked at the ground around him. The ants seemed to be coming together, as if they had one mind as if they were being controlled. And somewhere on his feet, one on a sock, crawling, crawling. The man is on a village path. He's stomping on ants. He is very scared. He looks down the path, sees something very frightening. There's a woman, standing in the middle of the path. She screams, terrified. The man attempts to calm her. Don't worry, I won't hurt you. But we need to get off the island, because it's here. And the ants. Everywhere ants. Where? Where can we go? How'd you get here? I don't know. It's as if I've always been here. Have you seen it? Do you know what controls the ants? Yes, I know. The ants? They never die. They never stop. I know. There is a man and a woman standing in the middle of the path. 
They are talking. Beach, we need to find a boat. We need to get out of here. We need to get away from it. Bats are everywhere. We gotta keep moving. Totally he grabs her hand. They run. They had to get to the train. Together, they ran as they had never run before. Past dark, foreboding trees, long abandoned buildings, and fallen structures. The path up the small hill, almost there. They fought back fear and exhaustion. The man pointed, the church. They could hide here. They would be safe here. They got to the beach. They looked out at the ocean. A boat. All they needed was a boat. They searched the horizon for any signs of rescue. Nothing. Time was running out. There were ants crawling up their legs. They frantically swatted them away. There was only one option left for them. They had to get to the church. Together, they ran as they had never run before, past dark foreboding trees, long abandoned buildings, and fallen structures. 